So clearing the CMOS on a valve steam deck, volume down, and the three dots give them a press and hold. Press the power button, you'll get a beep. You'll get a second beep. And then once that's occurred, you're waiting for flashing. Once there is flashing, you may let go and wait. Rather than end up with a steam brick, you now have a steam deck. Again, if you've undervolted or overclocked too much in either way, this will fix it. You will lose any modifications you've made to your BIOS, um, your operating system or systems should be completely unaffected as this is all to do with the actual hardware of the Steam Deck and none of the actual software, at least the software that the end user ends up dealing with. This is a somewhat slow process. Don't panic as long as you got your flashing and you can hear the fan still. It is still working. It may turn off and turn back on. Um, the only way to really notice that is to have your ear literally up to the fan but it will eventually turn back into a steam deck from a steam brick. If you've changed something that you shouldn't have changed, or if you've just overdone it, this is a great way to recover it. Thanks, guys. Hope you guys have a great day. Thanks for watching. If uh, you'd be so inclined, do all the regular YouTube things. I'd be much appreciative. Have a great day.